Excuse me, what time does this train arrive in Shanghai? Well, about Thursday. Have you by any chance seen a tall, dark stranger? Incredibly handsome, muscles like steel and built like a brick Kremlin? I'm afraid not. Neither have I. It's been a long, hard winter for both of us. Both of us? You must be Lola Alexandrov. And you are Boris from Petrograd. Do you have a secret message? I trust you know how to deal with a code. Of course. I go straight to bed and take two beach boys. You mean Beecham? I know what I mean. <laughs> what are your orders? Your contact is on the train, third compartment. Spend some time with them. Above all, make sure that you get the plans. Rather than arrive in Shanghai without them, I suggest that you leave the train at Minsk. But this is a non-stop express. We speed through Minsk at 90 miles an hour. <laughs> By God, madam, you learn quickly. <laughs> I shouldn't. It's not because I wouldn't. And Lord knows it's not because I couldn't. It's simply because I'm the laziest girl in town. <laughs> Turned out nice again, hasn't it? I was told to watch for hands at the station. Hey, you can't watch for hands while train is standing at station. <laughs> well, no matter. We have a long journey ahead of us. We can get better acquainted. Ah, this compartment is so dirty. Where does all this smut come from? Oh, I work it into all my pictures. You know, stuff like Cammy Nickers and my granddad's flannel at night shirt. I don't understand. Where is the innuendo? Oh, it's straight down the corridor, love. You can't miss it. I left the seat up. Enough of this broad Lancashire humour that has endeared you to everyone except me. <laughs> this innocent act doesn't fool me. Hey, mother! Perhaps my little, little friend will persuade you to sing. Eh, hey, that's champion. Oh, Mr. Wu, <laughs> what shall I do? I've got those kind of limehouse Chinese laundry blues. That funny feeling keeps round me stealing. Why don't you throw your sweetheart overdue? Oh, Mr. Wu, he's got the eye that flickers, you ought to see it wobble when he's iron and lady blouses, Mr. Wu. <laughs> what shall I do? I've got those kind of lime out shiny laundry blues. That <laughs> fella took my photograph, it cost one and three. I said, when it were done, is that supposed to be me? You probably must it up, the only thing I can see is my little stick of black pool rock there. I'm leaning on the lamppost at the corner of the street in case I said the little lady goes by. And sing he did. 
all the way from Murmansk across Siberia up and down the steps. He sang and sang. After two dozen numbers, I knew I was no longer partner. After he sang Falling in Love again, I knew I was in the wrong picture. <laughs> Oh, if you don't mind me saying so, love, you're a bit overdressed for Shanghai. When the weather warms up, you'll pong worse than a bank holiday Monday in Morecambe. I'm ready for all eventualities. Oh, well, suit yourself. Take me to the German Embassy. It's third left after Sydney Green Street and straight up Cleo Lane. <laughs> and Mr. Wu's a rickshaw driver now. <laughs> 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 